Hi everyone, this is a Lego Minifigures Series 6 opening video. I got 10 of these from the Lego store and I've already opened one and then I thought I should do opening video so and I finally got the one that I needed which is the Highlander and he's the one with the round shield this sword and he's got the like, plaid uh, pattern on and long hair long brown hair but the red eyebrows and like red beard so I finally got him he was the only one I needed for quite a while and I knew I felt my packs and I felt the round shield and I knew that was him so that's why I opened it. So I'll get on to the rest of them. I have nine other packs here. And I'll cut them open and quickly assemble them. And line them up. Okay, so. Very six minifigure pack. Okay, here's the first one. And what do you know? Uh, another Highlander. So, quickly put him together. There you go. His torso. His head. His hair is darker than his facial hair and eyebrows. I notice it's not red. The shield. It does have some paint on it. It looks almost as if there's not anything, but there is a little decoration. And we'll go for another pack. And we have the Minotaur or Minotaur. However you want to say it. Very cool. They're showing a thing on the History Channel right now about the Minotaur. Comes with two horns and an axe. And the horns it's not really accessories, they're meant to go on his headpiece. Okay. So, so far, three good ones out of the ten. I have seven left. We've got the mechanic. It's very nice. I like his uh, hair piece the most when I get the mechanic. And I'll show you that just in a second. He's got the biggest, uh, greasiest, combed back hair. And it's a really good hair piece. See it actually combing together all like that down in the center. And it comes up like right there. He's got like that old fashioned mechanic type hair, stereotype hair. He's got also grease on his face and grease all over his mechanic jumpsuit. It comes with a wrench and a toolbox accessory. The toolbox does not open, it's kind of like the stereo from other past uh, minifigure series. So there he is, the mechanic. Next.
It is the Intergalactic Space Grill. Here you see, she's got a really cool spacesuit that is in pink. And if you've never had a female spacesuit uh, that's come in pink before, this is the one you need to get. There's females in spacesuits, but they never had them in like this nice pink with this pink helmet. It's the same, it's like the helmet so pink it, it reminds me of a, a piece of bubble gum. She comes with the ray gun, like this for when you're not shooting, like this to simulate the ray shooting. It holds easily in her hand. This minifigure has the option of wearing the helmet or the blonde hairpiece, which is very nice flowing blonde hair. And the helmet does come with the blue visor, you just gotta snap it in. Make sure it's um upside down like that. And Her lips are silver. It's hard to get that impression from this far. They almost look, I don't know, kind of like dark, but up close in, in real life, they're like shiny silver. So. And there she is in her helmet. Very cool. And with her blonde hair. Very nice. Happy to have her. I've only got like, this is probably my third one. She's not that common to get to me in my in my situation. So, the next one. Another Highlander. I didn't get them like over three times of getting series six minifigures. And this time, I've got them three times. And these are the ones my mom brought from the Lego store. So, she didn't fill them either. This is just by chance. She's not into filling packs. <laughs> she just gets them. I'm glad I've got the ones I've gotten so far. I'd say probably about the drabbest one is the flamenco dancer, and that's pretty much obvious. She's, you know, like about the simplest one. She comes with a fan, and she doesn't have legs. She just has the dress. And I know um, the Statue of Liberty also has uh, the same kind of, like, dress legs or whatever, but she comes with the little, like... I don't know what it is. Printed piece with the dates and stuff on it. And she has a Lady Liberty um, like halo and a torch. So she's pretty cool. But I just think the flamenco dancer is kind of plain. Anyway, that's my opinion. So, so far, this is what I've got. And you can see three Highlanders. Anyways, you continue. I've got, after this one, I'm cutting open three more, guys. Alright, I got a look at it. And it is the chef. Or the butcher. I'm sorry. Or a cook, really. I really don't know. I think he's a butcher because he has a cleaver. He has one of those hats, like. If you go to like an old-fashioned hamburger place, they kind of wear these old-fashioned hats. A fry cooks, maybe. This is a really neat piece. I like him for the T-bone you get. Nice to have different Lego food besides the chicken leg or the turkey leg. They can hold this. It's a good-looking piece of meat. Although... It almost looks raw, but still, it's 
that's rare. So, and the nice cleaver. You can even use this cleaver in a horror film or something, a brick film which you need a meat cleaver in. There you go. So, like that. I have another one. Really, all I'm hoping for is just no flamenco dancer. Another intergalactic space girl. So I'll just quickly stick her together. And quite a few multiples so far. Um, there she is. I'll put her gun and stuff together in a little bit. Here's another pack. Nice. The genie. The blue genie. Definitely one of my favorites of this series. And I like his ghost-like bottom half, you can say. Oops. Put that on wrong. There we go. He actually can stud in on that ghost tail. He's blue, so he reminds me of uh, the genie and the lamp on. <laughs> Excuse me. Aladdin. The Disney cartoon. The old one. That goes. Oops. This is a little decoration with the jewel and the gold, like. Thing it goes right there in that hole, and he comes with, of course, a genie lamp. And he goes back in there, and then you gotta rub it three times, and he'll come out. Very blue genie with a unique purple turban. Very nice. And for my last mini figure pack of the ten that my mom uh, got me from when she went on a business trip. Here we go. What is it going to be? Another multiple of the chef or the butcher. Very cool minifigure. If you need, like, restaurant workers and things, I don't see why this can't be a good one. And he's got the T-bone and the uh, meat paper. Alright, so I've opened all ten packs. Here's the wrappers. And... There you can see all the ones I got. Alright, one genie, three Highlanders, one Minotaur, one mechanic, two intergalactic space girls, and two butchers. I'm very happy with these uh, ten minifigures. I hope you've enjoyed my opening video uh, and assembling them and uh, happy collecting. Thank you for watching and please subscribe. Bye.